Right, Colin, thanks. Well, losing a limb can be a horrific experience, but for one local man, his new prosthetic knee is making strides thanks to new technology. 23 ABC's Leah Steinberg joins us now with his story. Leah? Jackie, lower limb amputees in Kern County are among the first in the United States to receive the world's first and only motorized prosthetic knee. It was just a, you know, big blur. When Chris Allen got in a motorcycle accident a year ago, he never thought he'd walk again. I was on my Harley Davidson northbound on Old River, and a 19-year-old man texting on his phone flipped a U-turn and ran me over. He researched different types of prosthetics when he discovered Oser's new power knee, and he's one of the very first in the United States to receive one. It's a power-assisted motor, 70 pounds of torque. And luckily for Chris, Trevor Townston, a certified prosthetist at the Valley Institute of Prosthetics and Orthotics, recently became one of the very first of a limited number of people to be certified as a power knee provider in the U.S. It's really, really awesome, really rewarding. The power knee is designed to replace lost muscle function that gives Chris the ability to climb stairs and do other daily tasks that he says he'll never take for granted again. Well, when I got my leg, I got my independence back. You know, I got my livelihood back. I can walk and not depend on somebody else to be there to help support me with, you know, anything. But the price tag for this state-of-the-art technology isn't cheap. So the MSRP for the knee from, from Osher is around $68,000. Um, Kaiser reimbursed a, a good portion of that. But for Chris, the cost of his life is priceless. Still saying you, you don't know what you have until you lose it? Well, lose a limb and then you'll understand what it means. And the knee is also built to walk on tough terrain like grass, concrete, and slopes. In the studio, Leah Steinberg, 23 ABC. All right, Leah. How liberating for him. And any price is worth getting Absolutely. mobility and livelihood back. Yeah. Right. Well, a walking.